Coach Newman, first, welcome to the Big West. You are in your first year as the head coach at CSUN. What are your expectations of your team right off the bat? Super excited to get started. Obviously, it's been a while since I've been in the Big West. Uh, Ten years ago, I was at Fullerton as an assistant and now back at at Northridge here 10 years later. So we're back and uh, we're excited about the opportunity. Um, I really like our team. Uh, we got four uh, returning guys that are uh, really good players. And then we went out and um, brought in nine new ones. So hopefully uh, those guys will mesh quickly and uh, we'll get on to, uh, to our winning ways. You talk about some of the new guys and transfers. Are there any standouts from your vantage point so far that we should look out for? Yeah, you know, uh, Deshaun Allen Akins is having a great uh, preseason here. He's uh, older and, and been in the program for a long time. So really excited about what he's going to bring uh, to our program. Uh, Deontay Bostic, another one of those players uh, returning from last year's team, averaged uh, double digits. And and uh, he's really kind of coming into his own. He fought some injuries last year, and and uh, I think he's through those now and and uh, ready to uh, to have a full season. So those two guys are, are uh, um, you know, from the returning uh, standpoint, are, are ready to really make a, a difference this year in the Big West. And, and then, uh, you know, Gianni Hunt, the transfer from Sac State, uh, has had a great uh, summer and, and fall, and so we're hoping uh, that uh, his waiver goes through and and uh, he's ready to, to play for us here on day one. As you're getting to know these new players, do you have a specific coaching style and philosophy that you plan to integrate? Uh, yeah, you know, um, obviously my my uh, the history behind us, uh, you know, when we were at Fullerton, we played really fast, scored a lot of points. And that was something that I kind of took with me to uh, out to Texas uh, and then back to San Bernardino. So we're going to play fast. We're going to score a lot of points, which um, all of these guys are super excited about, uh, uh, doing you, you don't have to convince, uh, you know, young college basketball players that, uh, you know, we're going to play in a style where they get to score a lot of points. So, uh, they've been very, uh, fun to coach and, and really looking forward to, to that and playing our style of basketball. And now hopefully, uh, we can, uh, keep points off the scoreboard as well and, and hopefully win some games, uh, doing it that way. Earlier on, you mentioned how you have been no stranger to the conference, although you may be new to CSUN. You spent 10 years as an assistant at Fullerton from 2003 to 2013. Have you been keeping tabs on the Big West from afar? Do you have any key takeaways of the conference? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, no. uh, Having spent 10 years and got to know a lot of the coaches, um, always keeping tabs on the Big West. And and, uh, even though... Uh, I don't, you know, how much uh, television even makes it out to West Texas, not sure, but we were able to get some big West games out there. And uh, and so it was fun to watch the conference and see some of these guys. And, you know, obviously uh, what Santa Barbara has done uh, over the last couple of years has been, you know, remarkable. And and Irvine's got a great program there. Coach Turner does a good job. He had just started uh, building that thing when we left and and, uh, so knew that was going to uh, grow to what it is now. And then uh, Coach Gannad and at Hawaii's built a, a great thing going on there. So all these guys, you know, really it's, it's, uh, you know, it's been fun. And then watching the Big West grow and, and add uh, UC San Diego and, and Cal State Bakersfield. Um, that was great. I actually had a chance to compete against Coach Olin in the CC2A when, when, uh, when San Diego was, was uh, in our league at San Bernardino. So, um, been fun to watch, been fun to watch the, the Big West uh, grow in teams and and uh, watch them all compete against each other and, and raise the level of, of basketball in the league. And I know at San Bernardino, you did lead the program to an NCAA Final Four finish. How are you planning to replicate that same level of competitiveness and execution here at CSUN, although, you know, it may be a new group of players? Yeah, you know, it, it really just uh, getting everybody to buy into to the way we do it. You know, basketball is is uh, um, there's a lot of different ways to do it and do it successfully. And every coach kind of finds what they enjoy doing and, and something that works for them. And and so I found kind of my niche as to how I do it and how I found success. And now, um, you know, it's just about getting, you know, the rest of our 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 players to buy into that method Um and uh, and get them all pulling in the same direction. So uh, the sooner we can get uh, those guys on board, uh, the sooner we'll we'll start finding some success.
Yes, well, we look forward to watching your team play this season. And once again, welcome to the Big West, Coach. Thank you very much, Chloe. I appreciate it. Really looking forward to, to being back.